Nice little warm up going on far inland, too. You may even top off in some lower 90s. SFO looking good there, too. No delays happening this morning. Really, the only kind of trouble spot, if you will, in travel that we see in our kind of region area will be up around Tahoe. Now, if you're for some reason headed up there, you'll get some thunder showers going on here for today. More tomorrow, Tuesday, and a Wednesday. Note those temperatures, though, still somewhat elevated in the above 65 degree range. You got 71 going on for tomorrow. This all underscores the fact of what we're talking about some of that moisture coming in from the south. This is now Monday morning. I want to go all the way out here to show you what's going on. Uh, we try to clear out a little bit. Here's the continuation of those thunder showers up in the mountains. And then we get to Tuesday morning. Not real, real impressive on here, but you can see the moisture in place pre dawn. And that may mean you might get a couple little drops of showers going on very early Tuesday morning. Let's go to the moisture part. Monday, 4 a.m. This is what it looks like. Give you a general idea. See a lot of tan color out there far east during the day it drops off. But this is Tuesday morning. So even at the surface, conditions have moistened up considerably in anticipation of all of that. So there's the flow pattern already kicking in here from the south. Tuesday morning models are saying we may get some thunder showers early in the day and then after we get some daytime heating that's also possible as well. That doesn't always show up real well here but the thing to really underscore here with these monsoon things is not so much in the way of just rain but also that thunderstorm activity. 70 going on for San Francisco today. That's a nice impressive high. The great for the ball game. Upper 50s meanwhile along the coast to lower 60s so we don't see a lot of movement there. We don't see a lot of movement along the peninsula, although some 80s here in this pocket, 82 for Palo Alto and also Redwood City. The South Bay, well, got a hodgepodge of some 80s, but they're still in the 80s here, 83 Cupertino. East Bay Shoreline, there you got some lower 80s, but ah, 89 for Livermore. So Tri Valley, mm, getting in the upper 80s to near about 90, particularly around the Carquinez Strait. That's another pocket that'll get hot. 72 for Oakland, 71 for Vallejo, onshore wind checks in. Vacaville's running away at 91, 80 for Napa and 85 Santa Rosa. So we get summer today, tomorrow back off on those temperatures with some scattered clouds developing in here, maybe a shower that will be pre-dawn on Tuesday. Tuesday's the big day for instability. And let's go ahead and call it kind of a mixed bag of sun and clouds to finish off the week. Stephanie.